Hey guys, well, welcome back to Walk and Talk Music Reactions with John. I'm John, for uh, those of you who have not seen this before. Hello. Um, I'm out walking and I'm talking and I'll be reacting. So this is another, actually person I've never even heard of before. So that's cool. And this is, now hopefully I'm pronouncing it correctly. This is, today's uh, video is brought to you by Mr. D. And he's uh, he's uh, submitted songs before, so hello again, Mr. D. And he said uh, it's Layla Zoe, pronounced Zoe, not Zoe maybe, Layla Zoe. I tried to look it up, I couldn't see anybody uh, announcing her or anything, so you guys uh, go with it from there as far as how that last name is pronounced. But I think it's Zoe, the Zoe, Zoe. Anyway, this is someday. And it's from the uh, Retrospective Tour 2019. Um, and did you know, Canadian blues, uh, Layla is a Canadian blues um, rock singer and songwriter. She, um, she's she been influenced by Frank Zappa, Tom Waits, Neil Young, and Janis Joplin. So you've got Tom Waits, great songwriter, interest, you know, interesting singer. You have Frank Zappa, great guitar player, silly, silly at times, but still you can't doubt his amazing ability on the guitar and the way he composes music. Um, then you have Neil Young, uh, great singer, you know, songwriter, lyricist. Him and Tom Waits go hand in hand, I think. Um, and then where Neil Young to me is a little more country setting, and then you have Tom Waits who's a little more city setting. And then Janis Joplin, and we know Janis, you know, just this soul, this, this voice that, you know, flies. So, that's her influences. So, I'm expecting a, maybe, I'm going to make a prediction. Check this out. I'm going to say she's going to sound like, well, some Janis in there. I'm going to go with some good lyrics, storytelling. We're going to go with that. And maybe a little Josh Stone thrown in there. Um... Yeah, let's go with that. So let's bring it up and let's see what it sounds like. Let's see what Layla has to offer. This is a song I wrote years ago. It won me a blues songwriting contest in Finland. It's called Someday.
Okay. Uh, yeah, definitely a strong voice. A lot of soul in there. Uh, there's bits of her that remind me of Bonnie Raitt too. Little little splashes, little uh, what do you call it in the cooking world? Little not splashes, little pieces and little dashes of Bonnie Raitt in there. Not, I guess I'm hearing some Janice in there. Uh, a lot of Josh Stone and um, uh, the the guitar work and the band and all that. I'm digging that. I'm I'm right in there with that groove. Um, it's just a it's it's a good just blues song um rock blues you know song and um now the lyrics i don't know sounds like there's a story going on in there but uh they're definitely not quite as clever i would say as a neil young or a tom waits as far as painting a picture um but maybe i need to listen to it again because i am listening to everything for the first time um but there's something about a guy and his daughters. Maybe he'll never see him again. And then some guy that planted all the mushrooms and stuff, but then he, uh, he died or something and he danced with the devil. So, um, so I'm not catching the whole theme of the song. So I want to be fair about it, but anyway, let's, let's get to part two and finish this bad boy up. Here we go. But he don't mind Someday he's gonna wake up And I'm hoping he's gonna find, find, find That he don't mind I'm not sure where it goes lyrically. Uh, one day he's gonna wake up and find that he don't mind. Is that what she's saying? And down in the dump. Uh, so I'm not really sure where it, where it went. Um, so I'm not getting that uh, Tom Waits, Neil Young vibe, but I'm definitely getting, as I predicted, some Josh Stone, a little bit of Janice in there. Uh, like I said, sprinkled in with some Bonnie Raitt, kind of. Um, killer guitar solo. I like the control he had over the guitar, the effects he used. He had some wah going in there, some delay. Um, so that was cool. Like I said, good, good blues rock. So I'd look forward to hearing some more by her. Uh, I'm going to go back and listen to this too and see what those lyrics were about. Cause she said she won like a song writing contest in Finland or something. So, um, maybe there's more to the lyrics that I'm, that I'm getting out of this. Um, and then I thought the only the other thought, thing I thought was weird was she said something about a saxophone here and play and let's play. And then it goes into a guitar solo. So I thought, I thought that was weird. Um, if I heard that right, but pretty sure I heard that right. <laughs> so anyway, I like it. Very cool song. Um, I will uh, definitely check out more of her. And uh, so now you guys let me know what you think down in the comments. Leave your thoughts, any new song suggestions, artists, anything like that. Pop them in there. Um, and then uh, we'll just go from there. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. 
And until next time, you guys enjoy your music, all right? I'll see you later. Bye.